Yo, what's up, Diesels? That's your boy, Mr. Ranger here, back at again with another Sekiro playthrough, aka episode. Today's episode, we visit Hater City. If you enjoy the video, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, and you know the subscribe button be right down below. Alright, let's get it. I'm surprised we still haven't talked to him about Dragon Rot Restoration. Sad to get that knocked out. And if you didn't know, that's like when all your homies be dying of cancer. Because that's a mechanic in this game. Legit. This game be having people go for chemotherapy and stuff. It's actually surprisingly realistic. But nah, for real though. NPCs get sick. And I'm sick of that mechanic. Let's get it. Alright, we gotta fly over here. We're using ninja kites and whatnot. We're talking to this ninja fool up here. He's like, yo, don't go that way. There's horrible things. Uh, he's like, I started an Instagram account. And I went over there and then they disliked my post. I'm like, you can't even dislike a post on Instagram. He's like, it don't matter. It really don't matter. They did what they did. They commented on my shit and they said, you suck, you suck. Quit it, quit, quit, quit what you're doing. You suck, you suck. And then I was like, Damn, dude. Just tell me how you really feel. And he was like, also, oh, there's the biggest hater of them all in this direction. He's such a piece of hate that he's on fire. And we're like, you know what? We're going to go confront that piece of hate. Let's get it. All right, but first, I'll show you a good route right here since it's a mini boss. You backstab this dude. You suck it. Drop down. Get his homie who'll be watching. I don't know, grass. I don't know what that dude be watching. Kill this dude because he's talking ish. And then you get the home. He's always aimed for this dude. Suck it. Cause, uh, and then I'll just kill that dude real quick. Because I don't like fighting the dudes with the swords. I just don't want to waste my time. And this dude will just take like take a straight up beating if you give it to him. Alright, let's get it. Forget that dude slumped in the corner. He had too much lean. Huh. Suck it. Alright. Then we're going to run forward, stab this dude, because he'd be waiting to ninja stab people. If we had ran this way earlier, he would have stabbed us. But we didn't do that, so he ain't stabbed us. Alright, bro, who are you shooting at, bro? Those are my homes over there. You know, that's a sick thing if you think about it. Who's really the bad guy in this game? The Ashina people are Lord Kuro's people. We're killing all of them. Genichiro just wanted to save everyone. Block it. We're at, we're low key half of the bad guy because we're just following Lord Kuro because he wants to escape. He's tired of being immortal, and Genichiro wants to use Kuro's immortality to save Ashina because it's getting invaded by these slouches, just like this dude. Oh, hey. Hey, better, better, hey, better, better, swing. Block it. Eat it. Alright, let's get us a uh, mini boss real quick. First, take this lady out. Ah. You can just jump up and death blow her. Freaking snitches, bro. Alright, this dude's got armor on, but he'd be fat as ish, so use your spear to grip it off. Suck it. And then you just want to beat up on him and take his lunch money. Hey! Why are you swinging like that, bro? What do you think that? Hey! Why? Who do you think this is, bro? Block that. Hold up. Who? Huh? How am I gonna block him sword to hand? In real life, you would have a big old gash in your hand, bro, because that would straight up slice you. -ish. It's unrealistic, some would say. You know what? That's what I want. Suck it. I want a game where, like, swords be doing real damage, you know what I'm saying? I know there are games like that, but I mean, like, a good one. Like, <laughs> just dissed all those games. Suck them. I mean, they could suck it. Why is this dude spitting fire, bro? He don't even know what my mixtape sounds like. Otherwise, his shit would be lava, bro. Hold up. Are you serious right now? Are you seeing this? Bro, bring it, bro. You ain't even tough. I beat all your cousins. And you're the only one that had the nerve to wear armor. That is, unless some of them wore armor and I just wasn't paying attention. 
Oh! Hey! I am getting hurt, bro. Stop it! I don't know who this dude thinks he is. Yeah, keep doing that, bro. It really worked the first time. You know what they say? That's like the definition of insanity. Repeating something and then expecting different results every time. Hold up. Ooh. Hey. Alright, bro. Dude, what do you think this is? Dude's getting wasted right in front of my eyeball. He's lit. Alright. Okay. Eat it. Goodbye. Give me that prayer bead, please. But now, nah, for real, like I was saying, I want a game where swords do like legitimate damage. You know how sweet it would be to play a game and then like every cut like cuts like like a chunk off of your enemy like it's realistic. It could, you could do like death by a thousand cuts. Do whatever you want. If you want to like cut their arms off, you can do that. If they try to block your sword with their hand, it will cut their hand off. Like that'd be nasty. You know that kind of makes me think of like uh, what was that game? That Metal Gear Solid game with uh. That one dude that was butt naked in Metal Gear Solid 2. Forgetting his name right now. But honestly, it's not that important because he's not that great of a character. Uh, and also the game that I'm thinking of. It's like Metal Gear Solid Revengeance or something. That game was okay. Uh, but I would want every cut to be like that stuff where he uh, selects where to cut and then cuts it into pieces. Because that would be sick. Yeah, we're just walking past all these enemies because they're trash. Nobody cares about them. Alright, there's the hater himself, bro. Welcome to Hater City. Population 1. A.K.A. That guy. Alright, and since he's such a big hater, we're going to use the most haterific method we can think of. We're going to cheese the ish out of this fight because nobody really wants to fight him. I mean, look. Look at his health bar. Dude's got three health bars, ain't, I'm not trying to mess with you, bro. Even if you are tough, nobody cares, because we're not doing that. So we're going to use the cheating cheater method, a.k.a. the cheesing cheese method, a.k.a. the hating hater method. A.k.a. we're going to stand in a very specific spot, and we're going to win the match. Off of one. All right. So you want to lure him over here, you want to stand over here, because he's going to try to swing towards you, so he's stuck behind the tree. Okay. And then you want to run over here, and you want to jump on this. This this part's a little bit tricky, I'm not going to lie, hold up. Okay, jump up, grab that. Now you want to jump over to that ledge. Alright, we got this. Okay, no we don't, I lied to you. Alright, let's try that one more time, legit. Ah, I missed. I'm telling you, it's trickier than it looks, alright? Oh my. I'm trying, dude. Alright, alright, uh, uh. Okay. Here we go. Come on, dude! How high is that ledge? This is like Ninja Warrior or something, you know, where you gotta run up the wall and shit? It's hard, bro. Alright, there we go, there we go. Alright, we got it, we got it, we got it! Ha! Alright, we did it. Second try. Alright. So now, you want to come stand in this very specific spot, aka the corner of this roof, and look at this. Goodbye! Dude, you're stupid, bro. Why would you keep swinging at us? You can't even reach us, bro. Alright, that was the hardest fight in the game, and uh, we beat it real quick. By hardest fight, I mean second hardest. Ganitra is harder, aka the final boss fight. Yeah, I just refuse to do this boss. Since it's an optional boss, why would I take all the pain and stuff from like fighting that dude legit when everyone says he's one of the hardest bosses you know and he is just don't want to fight him you know what i'm saying like if i had a peace sign i would throw it up but i don't so i'm not going to all right i'm just gonna go see what's over here real quick but uh yeah in the next episode we're gonna slap ganitrio's cheeks uh if you guys enjoyed this video please remember or feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And you already know, I'm going to see you in the next one. Where we clap Ganitra, bro. We talked to this old lady and she's like, Yo, deuces, diesels. 
And I'm like, you know what? I agree, and we're still alive, Holmes. Deuces.